This is a video of installing a line art wall mural. My daughter asked if she could uh, pick one of these out for her new room, and I said, go for it. She found the wall mural she wanted on the website called Society6, and she even found a $120 discount, so good for her. The instructions say to roll it out and let it sit for an hour, so that's what I'm doing here. Rolling it out was a bit of a challenge, but uh, everything about this project was kind of a challenge. So I said I was going to wait a couple of hours, but it's been over a day, but if, if one hour is good, then 24 must be better. You can tell after 24 hours that this stuff lays flat. I want to make sure that I don't um, put it on the wall in the wrong order, so I'm going to lay it out on the floor just to make sure I know which one goes where. I apologize for the bad shadows, but you know what they say, hang wallpaper while the sun shines. That's what they say, huh? <laughs> Hopefully I get better on the second sheet. No, this sucks. All right, so I did the first one, and it's uh, it's okay. And I did the second one, and I didn't film it because I was so frustrated with the first one. But the, the second one turned out slightly better than okay, and my daughter convinced me to go ahead and film the remaining. So if I actually post, if I actually post this, you get to see a. Um, sort of failure project, but as long as she's happy with that, it, it's, it's a success. One thing is it works, it looks a lot worse with the camera light on. When you turn the camera light off, it looks better, so at least right now, it's the worst it's gonna look. Maybe you can tell by the sound of my voice, but I was completely dejected at this point. Luckily, my wonderful wife was working hard to keep my spirits up. I guess they have it self here. Well, to make it more DIY friendly, but I've, I've hung regular wallpaper and this is much more challenging. My lovely wife is down here mm -hmm. holding the bottom of this. Is it good? I like, yeah. Mm -hmm. I like stickers, but not when they're this big. <laughs> this is a leftover scraper from a Bondo kit. Bondo for doing auto body stuff. But so that didn't even come with the wallpaper? No. Oh. Ready? Let's have fun. Yay! That's so fun. <laughs> I try to convince her to use the film, the cameras for other types of videos, but she's not interested. <laughs> no. <laughs> I like this giant crease. Third time's a charm. So this is a how not to do it video. <laughs> I got it matched up right, it's just not. Their lines are just a little bit abstract. <laughs> Please comment down below if you enjoyed the video, or I guess if you didn't enjoy the video, go ahead. And if you got any ideas of what you'd like to see in the future, please comment that below as well. Hey, I think you picked up I've on that. I've kind of learned that you like yeah, do this wedge and then you mm -hmm. kind of go at an angle of working your way to this corner. Seeing that. All right, you want to line up the bottom? I had to rake a little bit to try to get the line up better. Mm -hmm. The top one matches up. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The top one would be off if you match the bottom ones. Is it satisfying to push the bubbles out? There's nothing about this that's satisfying. <laughs> when you finish it, maybe. 
It'll be satisfying to see my dog happy. <laughs> Look how this one matches up. Look at that. But that doesn't, so I, I don't know. It's the design. I don't think that's the installer's problem. Nope. You try to want to keep the magic like it's Disney, so you don't like see the camera, the light in the in the shot. I need a fairy floating around you. <laughs> I mean, if you're gonna keep it like Disney. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you want to have a reenactment of that kid that you had in school one time? Mm -mm. My wife had a kid in fifth grade while she wasn't looking to stick tweezers in the outlet. Mm -hmm. It's just all I saw was sparks. Was it a paper clip or what was it? I think a paper clip. Yeah, it's gonna be kind of odd for fifth grade tweezers in the mm -hmm. classroom. That may not be more strange than. Well, it's, it's kind of odd that a 10 year old decided to put a paper clip in an outlet, but. <laughs> it's because nobody ever told him not to. It was your job as his teacher. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not his parents' job to teach him that. Of course not. It's your job. <laughs> I don't know if you're an NCIS fan, but no, Jethro Gibbs is rule 18 when it's always have a knife. So is MacGyver. <laughs> I don't think MacGyver had rules. <laughs> Actually, he didn't need a knife. He turned whatever he had into a knife. All right. Oh, <laughs> it's gonna hurt my jeans. 